called perfect weather for this 75 college football game between the Michigan Wolverines and the Fighting Illini of Illinois. The Big Ten standings will help amplify the importance of this ball game. It is not a ticket to the Rose Bowl. It does not lock the championship, but it certainly is a major step toward both those goals, and those are the ultimate goals for a Big Ten football team. Taylor bowls again. Searches a little bit on the right side and pops out. It is now a foot raise. Tony Bowles on his way. Can 18 catch him? Jones reaches. Jones grabs. Drags him down. Henry Jones saved the touchdown. No, sir. There's a touchdown to be scored on first and goal from the one to the big man. Jared Bunch. Touchdown, Michigan. He's a good receiver. Taylor pops out, reaches for his first down and gets it. Michael Taylor. Taylor's pass to the sideline, good. That's a very tough catch by Chris Calloway because Fester with their back will hand it to Horde and he's got a block on the corner. And Horde will punish you. And Taylor will pass it. Down the middle, pass is good to Derek Walker, tied in, and he's right on the marker for the first down. This shows you the confidence, shows you the confidence that Schembecker has in this young man. It'll be a 47-yarder into the win. He's 11 for 11 in field goals, and Bo has just put some heat on him here. Got a lot of lag on it! Good! Big kick! He's 12 for 12. He hits from 47 yards. That is a new Michigan record. 2-0-2 to play in the first quarter. And the Wolverines have gone back to the lead by a score of 10 to 7. If it's good, the game will again be tied. It is good. Beta Murray took his best leap at it and came up short. And so once again, we're all even. Oh. Happy birthday, Happy Elizabeth. Happy birthday is right. Now if they can just win the ball game, huh? This is Tony Bowles cutting it over the right side up to about the 26. Third down and about five. Little quick pop to McMurtry. And Greg McMurtry, a two and tailback. Howard's in motion. Ford with the ball. Bouncing around, looking for some help. Does all of that on his own. Gardner's the one that's given Bo Schembecker and the Michigan Wolverines all the fits. Third down and six. Taylor's pass is in a crowd, and it is caught by McMurtry. Can you believe it? He goes down. The ball pops out. He is down. There is no fumble. No fumble. He was down at the 40-yard line. Crowd getting into it. Pressure coming. Taylor gets it away. It is Bowles running in the middle. He's got the first down. Butts heads and goes to the 12. Michigan and the Wolverines go to the wishbone set from the 12 yard line. Reverse it to Desmond Howard to the three. It is second down from the three. Second down and two for the first down. Taylor, touchdown. Ten now, Michigan lead. Intercepted. Henry Jones. Penalty flag. Out of bounds around the 23. Fourth 
and run for the first down. George back. Gets it out. Incomplete. And Michigan has held. It's just good coverage. Good. They're not fooled. It's fourth and one. Top left of your screen. Donovan is covered by Murray. He thought he was going to continue to go to the outside. And that's just good coverage. Well, coach. Yeah, Illinois folks are getting grudging along that offensive uh, defensive front. Michael Taylor wanted to throw big. Now pumps his outside. And picks up a first down. Michael Taylor gives it to Bowles, and Bowles this time finds a little working room, picks up about six yards. The numbers on the right-hand side of the screen really tell you the whole story. Leroy Horde, the tailback. Michael Taylor keeping it. And another Michigan first down. Gets a punt, about eight. Second down, three. Taylor keeps it again, another first down. And run out of bounds inside the 25. Tony Bowles is back in now on second down in about 10. And he has the ball up the middle. He's got a touchdown. The Illinois team had a little grim jaw yesterday. He just shifty, long strider, hard to tackle. The Michigan Wolverines now may be in control of things with a 14-point lead. That's going to be picked off by Trent Welburn. He tried to force one, and see you later. Welburn stepped right in front. The intended receiver never had a chance at it. He's going to let it run out. And the game is over. And Farmerton, Ohio has had a big day. As two of its favorite sons meet in the center of the field. All of you made plays that helped to win the game. Yes. All of you. And it was a great team victory. I'm happy as a ticket for you. I want you to understand one thing, though, men. We have not won the Big Ten Championship yet. This is a big hurdle. This is a big hurdle for us to get over. But we're healthy. And, and we're eager, and we're tough, and we're going to finish this season. We're going to finish with a flourish, yeah. and we're going to finish two tough, more blue, and we're going to get better, more. and we're going to stay after them until we win the championship again yeah. and back to the Rose Bowl. That's our goal. Yeah. I can't recall that there are too many games in my career where I was more proud of a football team than I was ours in Champaign. Because, brother, we played football on both sides of the ball. We went after them. They were a good team. Sure, they moved the ball some on us. Who, who shuts down Illinois completely? And sure, there were times when we couldn't move the ball and didn't score. But uh, we, we played a great football game at Illinois, and that's where we won the Big Ten Championship.